clear for now. If they hit us, my best hunch is it'll be from the chasm. If? You feeling optimistic, Lieutenant? I tell you, the Colonel could lose his own ass if it wasn't pinned on him. <laughs> you see our absent friend down there? Silly. No, he's gone. We're facing an enemy we know zero about. An enemy of unknown size and their home turf. Sucks to be us. I don't know how long those doors can hold them back. The radio's our best shot. We fix it up, call in the cavalry, even shit up a bit. If there is a transmitter up there, it's gonna have a limited range. One thing Eric did manage to get right about this shit show. He gave us air support. Lord loves a miracle. If we get that soon allowed, our birds may be close enough to hear. Still means we have to find a way to reach him, of course. One problem at a time. set up a fake dig site to draw off grave robbers. Whoever was down here it was pretty special. I'm gonna need a hand to get this up and running. Thing looks like it was sabotaged. How would they do that? We gotta work with what we have. Fall back if anything moves out here. It's safer inside. Thank you. Good job, Sergeant. Things will kill you, Sergeant. Yeah, like smoking is the biggest threat to my life right now. Fuck that, I need a lighter. What's good? It's nothing. It's just a ghost signal. Even without a transmitter, a radio picks up a faint signal. It's just ghosts, man. So fix that transmitter. If we can establish a signal and contact CENTCOM, then we're one step closer to home. I don't trust any of you pussies to do it. What the fuck, Lazarus? Sit your ass down. Back from the dead, baby. <laughs> Corporal Merwin, probably best you stay here and recover. Oh, and that you have all the fun? Oh, fuck that. Let me break this down to you Barney style. I'm the only one here who's a mechanic. Now, that's what you call a no-fucking-brainer. He's got a point. I'm 
قول هناك هو ده العدو الحقيقي سليم انت اتجننت اسمعني ارجوك اسمعني قتلوا الامريكان كانوا هيقتلونا انا اسمعني انا شفت غول بعناية دول وقتلت واحد اخرس وامشي ورايا انت سامعني خالص لا انت اسمعني دلوقتي يا اما تمشي ورايا يا اما خليك هنا وتعفن اختار الله يلعنك استنى انا جاي Have much time. Yeah, I thought I could take a Sunday morning stroll. You know, taking the view. Five or two minutes. Two minutes? You hoping to do it twice? Score one for the lieutenant. Colonel, back inside the temple and man those cameras. You're a sick duck out here! Go! One, two, Coyote, two. We are requesting evac. Over. Ugh. If anyone's out there, if anyone can hear me, we're requesting immediate rescue. Over. Mailman two, one. This is Rhino, one, five. Say again. Over. It's here, support. We need immediate evac. We're trapped under the LZ and facing multiple unidentified hostiles. You need to get the fuck out of here. Over. Solid copy, Mailman two, one. Roger. Wait out. Oh, 
there, Wabbit. Got any sense? They'll stay back. Shit's about to get real in here. Wait. Rachel. Rachel. <laughs> You're alive. Have any doubt, Marie? I'm so sorry. You followed climbing protocol. You had no other choice but to cut the rope. We don't need to discuss it. We both would have died. You have to understand that. <clears throat> Are we good? Tim, isn't it? I understand you're not the brightest, Nick, but even you must know what I'm talking about. You've been fucking him, haven't you? That's the best you got? Stop it! I know what Tim Rage. I know. You better step off before I start swinging. Colonel or no Colonel? Don't, Nick. I tried waiting, Eric. I really did. I'm sorry. Always loyal. Always loyal, huh? You weren't so loyal when you cut the rope. It's good to see you, Rachel. Thought we'd lost you. Who else made it through? It ain't good. Merwin's gone. Those things. They got Joey. Clarice. What is it? Therese was infected. Those things, I don't know how they got inside her. I couldn't take the risk. I had to leave her behind. You telling me Clarice is still out there? That's not Clarice anymore. I saw her changing before my eyes. I believe it. Same thing happened to Joey. You armed? Make sure every shot counts. Fall back to the main temple! We can't lose the generator! We're blind without it! I need help! We can't let any of those things through! We need. Is this place mined? Not mined enough.
turning now, or we're all screwed! Has a time. Come on, come on. There's gotta be something. Wait! Yes! Okay, we can make for the catacombs. We need to go down. Down? In case you missed it, that ain't the way out. It's either that or we die where we stand. Everyone move to the east gate! One of your better ideas, Rach. Hello again. 
My friend is not happy. Yeah, I can see that. What happened up there? Your friend's a little too jumpy for my liking. It's making me nervous. Lowering your weapon might help alleviate some of the tension. Make a move. I fucking dare you. I feel like our uniforms are getting in the way of what could be a beautiful relationship. Mashaban, shut up! I say we drill these sorry looking motherfuckers. What do you think, Colonel? I'm a beauty! Make the call, Colonel. We need their help. They're the enemy, Nikki. We have to help each other. It's the only way. It's them. We must get this door open. Why are you standing there? Help! Don't even think about it. Fuck, Jason! The enemy of our enemy is our friend! Move! Come on, man! Damn it! Help them! I'll cover the corridor! Shit! Move! in the goddamn world.
Teach you to mess with a Marine. I come in peace. Don't you fucking move. All this shit, it's on you. If you people hadn't ambushed us, none of this would have happened. I don't mean you any harm. I swear. No shit. I'm the one holding the gun. Honestly, I'm just glad to see a human face. Me too. Your friend said, the enemy of my enemy is my friend. That is not always true, but if we both want to live, we must fight as one. The sword and the shield. They're too wordy for my liking. But I'm in. For one second, you're trying to cross me. Best believe me. The following second, you're dead. I kill vampires. 
You think I'm afraid of a jar head? That looks like our best way through. One of us holds up the gate, the other can slip through. Find another way around. I think there's a way through. I just need to clear it from my side. Do it quick. Those things could be anywhere. You got any idea what we're dealing with? They're vampires. Not possible. My father once told me, if something looks like shit and smells like shit, you don't have to taste it to know that it's shit. <laughs> Believe me, they're vampires. We must work together to defeat them. Yeah, it's beginning to look like that. Dad! First thing you're gonna do when we get out of here. Hold my son. p.m. Something unholy has happened. As I sat with my wife, I noticed something in her hand. Lady Bradshaw's brooch. She must have pulled it from her shirt when she grabbed at her. Turning it over, I noticed that it looked like one of the creatures we'd exhumed from the cocoons. Were these the demons Mary had spoken about? Had Bradshaw known all along what we'd find down here? Then Mary's corpse moved. It was not my wife. It was something inhuman. It leapt at me, and only the bars of the cell spared me from its fury. Seem like you got your head screwed on. So I gotta ask, what the hell made you sign up with Saddam? For us, we had no choice. What is the meaning of those markings on your hand? to honor the dead. It's the reason I fight. It's as good a reason as any. It's a damn good reason. The only reason. I have no grievance with you. Maybe you need to switch on the news. <laughs> Listen. There was a man once who built his house on the banks of a river. When the floods came, his wall washed away. When the droughts came, 
The water dried up and the man was thirsty. All day, the insects bit this man's flesh. Yet each night, he says to his wife, we have all the fish we can eat. Your people chose this war, Jason. I think you need to give your mouth some rest. <sighs> I say we get the fuck out of here. Looks to me like a medical bay. This could come in handy. If you want to stick 60 year old explosive in your back, be my guest. Those chemical weapons are close, right? You wanna hear a joke? First of January, 1947, 1 a.m. The saboteur has struck again, sealing us in here. We are hopelessly trapped with those things. All around us, they shriek from the darkness. Crow has set up his machine gun, pointed towards the catacombs. Mary was right. We cannot fight that which does not live. There is only one option now. Bring the whole damn temple down on them. Even if it means bringing it down on our own heads. They cannot be allowed out of here.
those cabinets. Whatever's down there, those explorers got there first. Now hold up, will you? What are you doing? You think they're still alive? That's hopeful. Hope is all we got left. someone for years and never really know them. I had no idea my captain was married. That the asho you were with earlier? He didn't make it. Works for me. Only this bad guy to deal with. A time will come when you'll deeply regret this manner. I don't carry regrets. What do you make of it? It's like nothing I've ever seen. You see that elevator cable? The explorers must have gone down. I don't think they made it back up. That winch still looks functional. No. No? We are not going down there. The archaeologists didn't make it out. What does that tell you? We're not archaeologists? Our world is up there, not down below. Well, there's an army of monsters between us and the world above. They're close. Fire up. You're crazy. If those vampires come from anywhere it's down there, you really want to find them in their own home? What I've been doing since I set foot in this country. Get that elevator working. Ancient horror has awoken from its slumber and is hungry for blood. Shall we see how many have fallen into shadow? Rachel found her way back to the light. Well done. All a lie. Although don't get complacent, their lives still hang by a thread. 
Let's hope nothing unfortunate has befallen Sergeant K. Those taken by the abyss seldom live to tell the tale. As for Jason and Salim, sworn enemies who cannot seem to bury the hatchet unless that hatchet is buried in a bag. I don't want to seem like an ungracious host, but time is against us. I'll be here to greet your charges as they cross the finishing line, or to bury what remains of them under it. Smells fried. We're in hillbilly territory. What were you expecting? Cantaloupe caviar? Not exactly honeymoon material, is it? <laughs> I recall a certain somebody saying that she wanted to go ice climbing. Ice climbing is relaxing. What is it? The guy who served me. I don't know. He was, he was looking at me pretty strange. Yeah, he probably doesn't get to see a woman like you around these parts very often. Especially one who showered. <laughs> uh, he was saying some weird shit. Such as? It's nothing we should go. No, come on, tell me. He said I'll never again be as happy as I am now. What the hell's that mean? You don't believe him, do you? Of course not. You know, my sole objective, Rach, is to make you happy. Doesn't matter where we are or what we're going through, I'll always put a smile on your face. <laughs> See? I told you. Next time, all you have to do is whistle, and I'll come running to defend your honor. Oh, like my very own loyal puppy dog. Semper Fi. He means always loyal. I'm more than capable of looking out for myself. Now get your feet off my dash, you hillbilly. I thought I lost you. I thought I'd lost you. Right. Eric. Malfunctioning. Colonel, you gotta go! You too, Nick, you're coming with us! Come on, Ray!
All clear. That was too close. Come on, Marine, follow me. Think that thing's gone? Looked like it went down that tunnel. He's alive. Jason's alive. Maybe things aren't going so badly after all. I can't do this anymore. It's time. It's gotta be time. Time for what? You know what? We lay the cards on the table. You can't keep playing this, man. Nick, listen. No, 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 you listen. If I get killed down here, I want to know I stood up like a real man, not some chump. Rachel, you you said you tell him when the time was right. I need you to tell him now. Tell him the truth. You don't wear a ring because your marriage ended a year ago. He's right. It is time. Roll it out for us. Now? Right fucking now? Yes, now. We may not have another chance. <sighs> Fine. Eric, you and I, we had something very special. But that was a long time ago. I still love you, Rach. This isn't about choosing. It's about knowing what's best for me. I was on my way. I was making a new life for myself. But life has a way about it. Today, I've seen the same man I fell for all those years ago. I want to try us again. After all that shit he put you through. That's just it. I can't turn my back on my past. If I didn't give you a chance, I'd always regret it. Don't say another word. I'm sorry I came to this. I understand. Colonel, ma'am. Let's go find Kolchak. Thank you.
I've seen some fucked up shit in my life. Nothing comes close to this. They don't seem to be following. Do you like to wait for them, or...? I'll need to be a smart ass. Let's move. Think this is a safe way back? What the hell was that? Things came from here. Smells like formaldehyde. This. They don't teach you American science at school. You should stay clear of it. Belongs to Randolph Potion. Maybe he's got some intel that could help. That didn't help him. 